Yo, what up my scrubs? Welcome back to another episode of Danganronpa V3. I mean, it's not, I just don't see this game getting better than freaking last episode. Last episode, no matter how good I am at figuring things out, I would have never figured that out. Because the game did something that Danganronpa has never done before. They can't just throw a curveball in like that. But anyway, if you missed that episode, be sure to check it out right here. I asked you guys to, uh, as always, hit 30k likes, and you guys did it. So, a promise is a promise. I'm gonna go get my bop it. We got that original bop it. Please tell me it still works. This thing is so old. They don't, I don't think they make these, this version anymore. Oh, there, oh, there we go. I tried twisting this. I just can't believe it took five episodes to get this. Oh, why are they gonna? They were so young and talented. Why are they gonna start like this? How could this happen? Oh, that's not even fair. Sorry, I have control of my own editing right here. See, I can I can put, take myself away. So if I go away, and also sorry about my messing up my mic. I fixed it. I think it sounds a lot better now. So hopefully, your guys' ears sound good. No words can describe the loss we feel. <laughs> it looked like an accident. They were running away from that group. Wait, wait, no, this isn't. This is different. This is real it's life. Really, just an accident, though. I honestly can't believe that. I can't say it too loudly, but they were probably killed by that group. Oh, is this like? Did they just presume her being dead when she got kidnapped? I thought so. Oh no. Well, there's nothing we can do about that. I wanted them to live. For our sake, at least. Jeez. I wish they lived. No. They should have lived. They had to for this world. Oh my god. Is there a twist? There's a twist in here. A thin line divides heaven and hell. Alright. Chapter 2 finally starts. These chapters are no freaking joke. Where are you hiding? Come out. No more hiding. Come out now. Gonta! Gonta! Hey! Come on, bugs! Where are you hiding? He's just trying to catch some bugs. Just want Gonta to think he finds some dead gun. Weird, really weird. Plenty trees, grass, water, sun, but no bugs! Why? Weird, so weird. Hey, bugs! If any bugs here come out, Gonta want to talk to you. Huh? He just want to talk. What's that? Something on ground in grass? Words written on it? Oh, what did he find? The next motive or what? Horse A. Horse A. So who's the main character? It's gotta be Shuichi, right? That's what I'm assuming. Ugh. Oh yeah, it's definitely. Well, in until he dies. <laughs> See, the problem with last episode is I didn't even consider Kaede possibly being the victim. There's, or not, not, not even just the victim, but the murderer. There's no way because I thought that was impossible. So why would I ever think it? So now this changes everything. Now I'm going to be suspecting everyone in the game, which is really cool. Really cool. Easy now. Settle down. My God. I'm coming. Oh, this dude. Hey. You here to punch me again? What are you doing? It's uh, morning already? Huh? Kaito? Uh, um, uh, do you need something? Come on, man. Uh, yeah, food. Jeez. I was gonna eat breakfast with everyone in the dining hall, but you weren't there. That's why I came to get you. Kaito, you do care huh? about me. Uh, I don't really recall making any plans. I mean, you should be at the dining hall. Anyway, I mean, uh, where else are you gonna eat breakfast? Hey! I don't usually eat breakfast, so... Huh? Oh, are you serious? If you don't have breakfast, then what do you eat in the morning? Huh? All right. What if he fasts? People do that, intermittent fasting. I'm not ready. Let's get... Let me get my... Actually, never mind. I don't need that anymore. What? Okay. Oh, is he not gonna wear his hat? Ah. Please, please, I need to see Shuichi without his hat. Mm. Writing. Honest. Yeah, like someone tried to hide writing in grass. Weird, right? Uh. Mm, Atua says it's just graffiti. <laughs> no, nothing is a coincidence in this game. Now we don't gotta worry about it anymore. Jeez. Atua, that's even more suspicious. My, my. Are you saying Atua is suspicious? How sad. Yeah. That's none of your business. Jeez. What's up with you guys? Are you still talking about that graffiti? You know. Whatever, I bought uh, Brasuichi, so let's start breakfast already. I knew it! 
I knew it, man. It's not even like a coincidence anymore. His hat. <laughs> Look at him. I gotta give you a full full view of his of this glory, glorious view. It is no longer a coincidence anymore. If you have an aho gay, you're the main character. If I would have saw that, dang, what a what a surprise, man. He tried to hide it. Uh, <laughs> I love that. Money. That's so good. Oh, Shuichi. Um, you finally got rid of that emo hat. Emo hat? <laughs> is this because Kayeti died or whatever? Quiet, you male. Learn some manners, why don't you? I feel like that would make him more emo, but okay. Oh, huh. You're not wearing your hat. I didn't even notice. And you can stand to learn some manners too, you insensitive jerk. I want to see a front side view of my boy. Uh, um... There he is. There he is. The true main character. Or so we think. Wait, wait, wait. The question is now, who else is wearing a hat? That is correct. If someone else is wearing a hat, you never know. They could be a true character too. A true main character. I like it. I think you look more handsome with your hat off. Hey, chill. How nice for you. I'm like plain Jane over here who turns invisible as soon as her glasses come off. I am plain. I am plain, but it's the other way around. Taking off my glasses reveals my true form. <laughs> Didn't you know? Those who see my true form pay a terrible price. Listen up. Anyway, don't be late. What does that mean? Chiwichi, we already decided we're eating breakfast together. You decided that on your own. Yes, of course. Yes, yes. I prepared breakfast for everyone. Huh? You did? That is correct. Indeed, it was no trouble at all. At all. I have prepared an Italian omelet, buttermilk pancakes, smoked salmon. And Ooh, that sounds good. And for those who prefer Japanese cuisine, I have prepared rice balls and miso soup. Hey! Kurumi, be my mom! <laughs> Goto wants you to be his mom too! <laughs> uh, okay, she's, she's gonna be mama then, alright. What are you two even saying? Oh yeah. oh yeah, I'll show you guys something really neat. Look, look, when Himiko eats, she makes the cutest face. Ah, uh, she likes a- she's like a small animal. Stop it. You're making it hard for me to eat. Yeah, so she's gonna be the cute one of the group, obviously. We chatted casually as we began eating. Okay. Amazing! Go to not me to flatter, but all this food is so yummy! Excellent! It's so delicious, it makes me want to cut off my tongue! Okay. <laughs> That's pretty good food if you want to do that. I'm gonna need you to take off your hat, dude. I need to know. I can't, I can't deal with any more surprises during those class trials, guys. <laughs> What's wrong, Key Boy? You're not eating? Oh, I Oh yeah, see. I totally forgot you can't eat because you're a robot. Hey! Hey, uh, just give him some oil. I don't know. Hey now, don't look so down. I'll bring you a broken TV wow. later. I don't want that. I'm not a waste receptacle. <laughs> Kibo and Kokichi seem to be getting along swimmingly. For now. For now, like, I just feel like one of them is gonna kill each other. We were having a normal conversation as if nothing had happened, but we all know it wasn't really normal. Yeah, she was- Kaede was the first to die. No, no. <laughs> I forgot about Rontaro. <laughs> How could they kill him like that without even telling us his, his, his talent? I'm so mad. Yeah, sorry we had to mute some copyright music too. Like, I know it was kind of touching. I didn't want to mute it, but it was copyright. Well, my editor said it was copyright, so he kind of, you know, had to put, take some stuff out. But, shoot, yeah, Kaede died freaking brutal, man. I look forward to seeing who I how everyone else dies. Quit fussing over some lousy graffiti and worry about some crappy future instead. Huh? instead. Graffiti? Um, Gonzo find it this morning. Hey! Horse A. Horse A. Okay. Alright, let's figure this out. So, Horse A. We can't rule out that the H could be an N. Uh, the R could be a V. It's probably one of those things. It's a, it's a Leon situation. Uh, well, it's mis- Its meaning is entirely shrouded in mystery. Horse A doesn't make any sense, so obviously it made something different. Not even the ultimate an ultimate anthropologist knows. I thought it was some anthropology no. thing. Well, how about it, Shuichi? Let's hear the ultimate detective's opinion. Huh? Uh, I don't know. I don't know either. But, but... Kata, I'm surprised you were able to find the graffiti hidden in the grass. Feeling divine? Did you channel the divine too? No. Oh, that cause of tiny bugs. Hmm? Bugs? I thought vermin were nowhere to be seen in this academy. Um... Yeah, Gonta think that before, but... But... When out walking in courtyard, Gonzo think he see tiny bug. But bug so tiny, even Gonzo could not see it. And Gonzo have 20.6. What the heck? So maybe Gonzo just make mistake. But Gonzo think maybe. No, maybe Gonzo just see things. Degenerate male. No, it's freaking probably little drones or something. Just make up your mind already, you degenerate. Me. How dare you talk to Gonzo that way? So you found that message while you were out chasing some bug? Oh. 
Wow, Gonta, you did it. I knew I could rely on you since the moment we met. Huh? What, really? It's true. Yep, so you should work for me. Got it. Okay. What? What, you're gonna agree to it just like that? Hey. Be careful, Gonta. That guy's a real liar. Oh. What, really? <laughs> so gullible. No way. Thank goodness. Good, then Gonta have no reason to worry. Huh? Will you just believe anyone? <laughs> Gonta, you're so gullible. You know, if you keep being this gullible, you'll be killed before you know it. Under oh my god. Oh my god. He's the blackened. The moment Kokichi said that word, the warm and casual mood shattered. What's the matter? What's wrong, everyone? Is there a problem with Kokichi's advice? You're a robot. You wouldn't understand. Oh, Kokichi, you should know say things like that, even as joke. Mm -hmm. Uh, what? Say kill? The word K... The K word has been banned? <sighs> Sorry, I didn't know. <laughs> but that's not very reasonable, is it? Not when the killing game is still mm -hmm. happening. How could you be so insensitive, especially after what happened yesterday? I'm that's why I hate degenerate mills. They're about as considered as amoebe... Uh, amoebe? I don't know what hey. that is. Amoebas? Don't complain if some scary guy yells what color is your blood at you. You really don't care. It's that kind of talk that lets Monokuma play you all like fiddles. Huh? What? Oh? Oh, did you hear that? Don't mind me. I was just talking to myself. There he is, the bear of the day. Yoo-hoo! Hello, looks like you guys are having a good time. Let me join in. Yeah. Uh, they're having a jolly good time getting you up on me. Okay, so now that it's officially chapter two, we gotta see if his voice sounds different. What? Isn't that your fault? Huh? Ganging up? Hey! No bullying. Bullying is not cool. Bullying is the worst. You're Personally, I think bullying is kind of lousy parenting. <laughs> it's all parents' fault. They should do a better job raising their kids. Why are you even here? <laughs> I figured I'd give you guys a prize for surviving the class trial. Or is that a motive? Huh? Oh, yeah, so like I wonder if like in this game they're gonna unlock more stuff too. That's usually how it goes But I only saw like what one door or something like that. I don't know Rise and shine or shine. Unlock. Oh, wow, so Rise that one and shine or shine. Um, The reward right? Uh, right we bought it. Yep, so I'll just give it to you then uh? My kids seem a little under the weather even so they're still freaking adorable <laughs> Are you being bullied? Huh? Huh? That's um... I knew it. I knew it. I understand from experience. Huh? From experience, Himiko, you were a victim of bullying in the past? Is that why your heart is broken? You can't express real emotions anymore? You're the worst of the worst! Use your magic to turn the human rejects who bullied you into this happen wretches! Stop it. I don't use my magic for stuff like that. I don't just make up my backstory. Huh? Hold on, the Monocups bully each other? What? No way the Monocups should always get along. Oh my Hey, you kids play nice together, right? I'm not a lousy parent, am I? Oh, she's you're the worst parent, Monokuma, okay? Even if you do bully each other real bad, it's not because I'm a bad dad, right? We are all friends. We all get along. Yes, we do. See, my children are good kids. They would never bully each other. The bullying will never stop because of people like you. Oh well. Well, I think the threatening vibe we Monokups give off is perfect. And that's that. Because we a team of scary babe who are gonna drag you down to hit. <laughs> Such adorable little <laughs> Got it? Anyway, we're gonna hand out the rewards you've all been waiting for. Like an ocarina? Because we got these here fabulous, nonsensical prizes for you. Okay, well, alright. A dragon gem, an ocarina, an ancient passport, and a hexagonal crank from uh, some zombie game. These prizes all come in a bundle. Wow, what a, a bunch of random junk! Bra Yay! I don't get why these are prizes, but aren't they lovely anyway? Okay. Hey, that one bear sounds like Sonya. What? I know. Yeah, you guys told me in the comments too. I, I, I don't. I hardly ever read the comments because I'm too scared. But sometimes you guys will tweet me and tell me that the voice actors are are the same. Apparently every voice, I don't know if it's true, but every voice actor in this game has played in a previous Dog and Rumpa game, so it is kind of obvious, yeah. To tell you the truth. Honestly, I'm not sure. Maybe there's a way to use them without knowing what they're for. Who cares? Just put your best foot forward. It's easier to move forward than backwards. How oh, nice. Yeah. Don't get inspired by him, Gonzo. Yeah. Anyway, that's the situation, so just do your best however you please. I don't feel like going full Monokuma today. Let's go. What? You're gonna get payback for all the bullying by attacking us in secret our secret weak point. Oh. Secret weak point? You mean the nape of our necks? Oh. <laughs> Attack on Titan or what? Actually. Wait, so the nape of your necks is your weak point? I, I would never do that. I just want to get along. Get along, really? You stupid. Don't let him fool you. He killed Monokid, remember? He deserved it, okay? 
<laughs> that was totally a Attack on Titan reference. So what should we do with this jump? Could it be? Maybe we need to use this on those mysterious things all over the campus. Over. Oh yeah, all over the campus. And what'll happen when we do? Uh, I'm not sure. See. Well, we'll know once we try. I'll take the junk thing. Uh, no, let's leave this to Shuichi. Huh? What, me? Hey! You're the ultimate detective, yeah? You should be good at weirdo puzzles like this. Got it. So I'm gonna leave it to you. Uh, okay, okay, I'll try. Man. And whatevs, I guess that's fine. So I need to go around. Oh, all right. So do we actually have to like physically go? I wish there would be more interactive things where we had to figure things out. That's one thing I do wish there would be more in, in Danganronpa. Oh, what the heck? Okay, I know what this is. Oh, hey, 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 hey. No, no, go back. Oh my God. Okay, nothing happened. <laughs> Sorry. I, I'm still getting used to my controls here. The wall came down? Oh, ah. so that's how there's going to be new far parts unlocked. Was it because of my magic? No. Oh, no, I used an item on this object and magic. it was my magic. Uh, okay, um. sure. Watch me actually find out she really does have like real magic powers. Now that I've seen Ghost in Danganronpa game, even though people consider Despair Girls not to be canon, I, I don't know. That part was like kind of kind of sus for me. Like the fact that there was actually ghosts. The door is different from the others. It might be the ultimate research lab. But in the look of it, I guess it's the ultimate magician's lab. Oh, it's hers. That makes sense. Okay. I like she has like the sawing a half thing. As I suspected, it's full of stuff related to magic tricks. Mm -hmm. Whose research lab is this? Is it supposed to be mine? There should be uh, magical hey. items, right? Uh, um, uh, why are you asking me? Cauldron? That makes sense. They mix the magic tricks and real magic, but this is pretty thorough collection. Hey. It seems like there are labs for everyone, but why prepare so many? What is this place? Uh. Monokuma said the Ultimate Academy for Gifted Juveniles was made for the 16 of us. Mm. Is that really true? <laughs> yeah, the room in the dorms doesn't uh, don't locks, but the room in the dorms have locks, but the, these research labs don't. Okay. Oh, so they're not Are private. You okay? Are you okay with that, Himiko? Your magic tricks might get stolen. Mm. Uh, you need skills to perform magic tricks. Knowing how they work isn't enough. Ooh, I wonder if someone's gonna like fake their death or something. Nah, that would be stupid because then the announcement wouldn't play. It's magic. Uh, but I don't know. I'm just trying to think on how this stuff could be involved. Hmm, that's strange. There are fewer plants around here. Some places are being renovated as well. I barely even remember. They did say it was under construction. I suppose construction is still ongoing. But where exactly is this academy built anyway? No one has come to save us. It must be someplace remote. But where could you build a complex this large and secret? Well, if everything's going to crap, I guess I could see how they could do it. Oh, SeaWorld's here. Is that a casino? It is totally a casino. I can see it. <laughs> it says casino. <laughs> okay, well, the crank definitely goes here. There we go. I, I figured out my controls, guys. Don't worry. This is this is fancy. Hotel Kama Sutra. Okay. I don't like where this is going. <laughs> okay, let's check the casino first. Oh, I like that remix. That's nice. Hmm. What is this place? Is it like a casino? Rise and shine or shine. This place is not like a casino. It is a casino. Okay. Yeah, yeah. This place is a casino. You can earn lots of mana coins and exchange them for fabulous prizes. Oh, is it like a mini game that we can do? That's kind of cool. <laughs> so that was wonderfully amateurish, Mana Dam. It had a flavor not even Father could match. That's right. In a sense, you've surpassed Daddy. Okay. Which makes you a grandpa. <laughs> mana Dam, Grandpa Mana Dam. I, I don't know so why that was so funny. Yeah, why is a casino in a place like this? Welcome, welcome. At the casino, you can use special casino coins to play various games. You can exchange mana coins for coins at the cashier. Once you exchange them, they can't be exchanged back, so know what you're doing. No, this is lit. Literally, it's so lit up. Hey, you know what, Monokuma? He, he kidnapped us, but man, he got... He's got some taste, man. I'm going all in, baby. Oh, it's the mana freaking cubs. Wonderful. Oh, oh, oh my god. All right. I could, I could go... I could do this all day. <laughs> Hey, sometimes you gotta know when to walk away. Not bad, not bad. 
Right, I'm gonna try that salmon fishing, apparently. <laughs> How much can you bet? Oh my god, you can bet a hundred? Crap, what do I do? What do I do? Oh. Oh, we're looking for red. Crap. Oh, you have to press enter. That sucks. What the heck? S rank, baby! That- okay, this is easy. What the heck? Wait a minute, does the stuff you unlock in here actually- You, you have to use it in the game? A key of love. That sounds like it goes to the hotel. A book of the blacken. Should I buy that? Is it gonna like talk about other people? Why do they got a love hotel in this game? Alright. Rest, $25. Two guests, two hours. Overnight, $45. That's pretty cheap, though. I wonder if it's gonna be all fancy. What is this building? I'm gonna try to like the implication. Wait, can I not go in? What is over here? Uh... Oh. Oh. Mysterious... Oh, yeah, this, this is totally where we played the ocarina. I played enough Zelda to know. I'm oh, so right. The vine suddenly withered. Mm -hmm. The ivy withered in seconds. What a remarkable technology. Huh? We can get in. We can go in from there, um, right? You intend to go inside? That course of action seems dangerous. Ooh, this smells like freaking dope. I love it. It doesn't look like a normal school pool. More like a pool at a resort. There's not very much water in it. Aren't pools usually filled up more? Wow. This will be used in a murder. I've always dreamed of swimming in a fancy pool like some big shot celebrity. Um. Too bad I don't know how to swim. Then I suppose that dream is pretty far away. Hmm. It's not necessarily a dream of mine, but swimming with everyone does sound fun. Dude, he was just sink so fast. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Storage hmm. rooms in Danganronpa are never good. Hmm. I peeked inside and discovered all manner of pool supplies in there. It's fully stocked with kickboards, water polo balls, and even sturdy rubber inner tubes. By the way, perhaps I can float in water if I inflate them and attach them all over my body. <laughs> That's a great idea. And I think you would look like that tire company's mascot. <laughs> oh, the Michelin tire or whatever. So where are the swimsuits? I only saw extra uh, school uniforms back at the dorm. That's true, all the closets seem to contain his spare uniforms. Hmm. If there are any swimsuits, I suppose they'd be in the warehouse. <gasps> How scandalous! They're in a place that degenerate males have easy access to! Uh, um... I don't really think that's a problem. <laughs> oh, I get it. You're the worst! Degenerates the worst. only care about used swimsuits or the ones that girls are wearing, don't they? If that's the case, then the swimsuits in the warehouse are definitely safe. Okay, you seem like to have a mind that way. You seem worse. Oh, we have a rules. Okay. Hmm. So swimming is prohibited at night time. Rise and shine, or sign. Here we go. No one's allowed to swim during night time. Actually, it'd be terrible if someone died due to an unfortunate night swimming, nighttime swimming accident. And that's that. We need you to die in the killing game. So. You can visit the school at night time, but even touching the water is against the rules. Well, I guess I just add it to the existing regulations just in case. Uh, why is the pool's water level so low? It's barely enough to swim. What are you saying? What are you, what are you saying? You got some gaping holes instead of eyes or something? That's right! There's enough water to swim. It only looks shallow because the pool is so deep. Um, and someone would be more likely to drown if we pulled it up all the way. And that's that. They put a lot of thought into strange things. That's wonderful. What, really? I'm so happy to hear you say that. You stupid. Did you forget that he killed Monikid? You should hate his guts. Screw money, kid. I always hated okay. him. He was violent, vulgar, rude to shop clerks, and I had a soft spot for abandoned kitties. Hey. And and had and he had a soft spot for abandoned kitties. Why does that sound like praise near the end? So long, farewell. Bye bye. <laughs> so we're gonna get the beach episode coming pretty soon. Wait, school building. I remember all the windows being sealed off, but this window in particular looks like a normal window. What room does it belong to? <gasps> Anyone can peep through that window! Huh? Peep? Who would do that? Um, I hear degenerate males get more turned on by girls in swimsuits. Wow. Mm -hmm. And they go bonkers over the bloomers we wear! The bloomers! Oh, a gym window. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's pretty standard for a school to have the gym and the pool area near each other. Right! But I think the pool could be moved to a much larger area. There's plenty of land in the courtyard. What about the uh, are there? Um, I don't know. Okay. Well, that was it. 
I'm gonna guess the last place is probably the gym. Because I don't think we've been in there yet. No, we have. It's just that we haven't been in there since the beginning of the game. Or the dragon statue. Where's that at? Oh, man. I'm so right. That seemed like a pretty ex expensive statue. <laughs> Like there could have been other ways to save money. Or the wall's gone. Oh no. That's so cool. We can get past this wall now. All right, then charge. Oh. Wait, charging is dangerous. Um. Tell me, what's wrong? Yeah. Nothing, but I feel a stagnant air drifting from this damaged lump, as if no one has set foot beyond this point for quite some time. Huh? Nobody's been here for a long time. Exactly how long is a long time? Oh, it's the maid lab. Oh my God. What the heck? Hmm. This room, this room gives off an uh, antique vibe. These are Victorian. These decorations adorn the British Empire at the peak of the Queen Victoria's reign. Yeah. This must be my research lab. During the Victorian area, employing a maid was considered a status symbol. If I remember Speaking correctly. of the Victorian area, Jack the Ripper was from that time. Oh no. That I just think correct. of Toka now. Ever the detective I see. So this is the ultimate maid's lab. It does seem to be perfectly suited for Kirumi. I don't like that they talked about Jack the Ripper. It's not a good sign, guys. There's a doll at the dining table. Perhaps a family dinner? Is. This is my research lab. Then I presume these figures represent uh, those I must serve. I want to look at this fancy chandelier. Closet door. It's a big closet! Oh, it's like washing machine. This must be a paradise for her. <laughs> these appliances will prove most useful when I perform my cleaning. Huh? Cleaning, you mean the school? Karumi, you don't have to do that. I do not agree. Uh, to serve others is a maid's duty. Selfless devotion is the principle by which I perform my responsibilities as a maid. She's gonna kill the first person who is like really messy? <laughs> oh no, Gonta. <laughs> I cast aside my personal feelings for the sake of serving everyone. Hmm. I suppose that makes most sense when you're the ultimate maid. Most people wouldn't do that. Please let me know if you have a request. Given our situation, I will not take monetary payment. I will grant your wishes. Okay. Anything is kind of intimidating if you say it like that. Wait, she'll do anything? Go kill someone. <laughs> Imagine? She said anything. That's a blanket statement. All right, so that's all we had to look at in there. Uh, now I'm really curious as to know what we need to do because we used all of our items. Oh, that's obviously hers. Okay. <laughs> Ooh. I wonder what this is. A treasure chest? A treasure chest? <laughs> We found a treasure chest! Why don't you open it, Shuichi? Huh? Really? I should I should oh, open what? it? I believe this treasure chest is saying you should open it, Shuichi. Huh? The heck? I thought it was like Luigi's like vacuum or something. A flashlight? No, it can't just be a flashlight. <laughs> Maybe try turning it on. <laughs> she keeps suggesting to do things. Huh? If you're so eager, why don't you flip the switch, Angie? Well then. then I'll meet you halfway and inspect this flashlight myself. Huh? Meeting me halfway. Bye, huh? Once you understand, I'll come teach you. Uh, bye. Oh, oh no. Angie snatched the flashlight from me and ran off with the bounce of her step. But... Wait, inspect it how? What does she do? Yeah, what does she actually do? Based on the design, it could be the ultimate entomologist lab. Oh, Gonta! Look at all those bugs! I like how they're all fake too. Amazing! This paradise! I, I suppose I should keep my opinion to myself for now. Yeah, I don't like bugs either, man. That would. I would not want to tell him that though. Amazing! Gonta, wonder how many bugs there are. Gonta's so excited when he gets his own special room. Mm. Who makes this room anyway? Gonta needs to say thank you. Huh? Um, I suppose it was Monokuma and the Monokubs. I mean, the reason why I love Gonta so much is that no matter what situation he's in, he's always happy. And it's like, we can learn from Gonta. Right? Huh? No way, Monoku Monokuma. Yeah. But no person who likes bug can be a bad person. Gonta said, hmm, lots of larvae and eggs, and they even sleeping in cool place. Uh, they were um, refrigerated? What? It's okay, eggs probably hatch if Gonta take good care of them. Well, well do your best then. 
If all these hats, there, there'll be bugs all over the academy. Releasing all these bugs in a new world, it's like the Bible story, or that Bible story, Noah's Ark. If I remember correctly, the world was destroyed by a great flood and humans and animals began. Perhaps that's a little too dramatic. Oh, it's the ultimate tennis lab. Yeah, now this is cool. This is really cool. Um, this is your lab, right, Ryoma? It must be nice having a whole tennis court here. <laughs> I don't care. I have nothing to do with tennis anymore. Nothing to do with tennis. Hey, Ryoma, are you really not going to play tennis anymore? What was that? Tennis? Who the heck plays that hoity-toity sport like tennis? Sure. Oh, that's right. I totally forgot. You're a tennis player, aren't you? Threw away my. It's past. fine if you forget. That was a long time ago. <laughs> so when you killed the mafia with your bad at cool tennis skills, was that a long time ago too? Wait. Hey, come on, Miyu. What was that? Uh, what? It really happened, yeah? No. Yeah, it's true. Thanks to that, even if I escape from here, I'll just go straight to a different prison. Uh, so it'd be meaningless for someone like me to play tennis now. So he has nothing to lose. Then why are you staring at a tennis court with such sad eyes, Ryoma? Are you a little b- <laughs> Cause you're acting like a little b right now. What's what? with the stare down? You're scaring me. I really thought she was gonna die. Last, uh, last game. Oh, shower room. Oh, I didn't even see that. Oh. There's a shower room in the back. <laughs> A shower room? Why don't you boys go in and give each other a good scrub down? You're already the perfect height, Ryoma. <laughs> You'll be lined up just right when you t uh, turn around to face Shuichi. What? Dude, this- Oh my god. What the heck, Rad? I was kidding. I thought you'd laugh. You're awful. <laughs> She's awful. All right, whose lab have we not been in? We haven't been in her lab, I don't think, right? I know we've seen it, but I don't think we went inside it. I tried, but it wouldn't let me go in. Hmm, this looks interesting. Uh, alright, whose lab is this? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! This kind of looks like the door in the first game, doesn't it? That's what it reminds me of. But we can't even do anything with it, so I'm guessing it's just a wall and I'm just dumb. But it looks like a door. Hmm. Wait, shouldn't this be his by now? Oh, oh, crap. I did not give you permission to enter. Huh? Maki! So this is the ultimate child caregiver lab. That's true. There's just a bunch of kids in there? <laughs> oh. Can I look inside for a bit? Uh, no. Huh? What? But there's no rule against people going into each other's labs. I don't, know. I don't care about the rules. I'm not letting anyone inside. What's going on? Hey! What's going on? You guys are in the middle of a tiff now, are you? <sighs> See, thanks to you, an annoying brat has showed up. Because? You hear that, Shuichi? An annoying brat has showed up, all because of you. Uh. Okay, yeah, so? so what's up? You don't want anyone to enter your lab, Maki? Don't don't be so pushy, Shuichi. It's not good to do stuff that'll make girls upset, you know? Uh, um, okay, I understand. Then? Good, then stay away. If you try to go inside, it'll be extremely painful. For you. Okay, don't mess with her. <gasps> painful? Okay, that's that's extremely sus. The game clearly wants doesn't want us to go in there. Hmm. What is this? It's, it looks like a door, but it's just painted on. Speculate, but I don't care. Yeah! Oh, 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 something. Something's happening. Oh! Oh, I didn't know you were here. I've been looking everywhere for you. Huh? Did you find out anything about that flashlight? Uh... I finally figured it out. It seems like a two of wants us to gather in the gym for an explanation. Bye, Onara. Uh, you don't have to you don't have time to relax now. Bye, Onara. I knew we would have to go to the gym. Please Everyone. be the next one. Everyone gather around. Time. We all here? Good. Then let's bow our heads and pray to our two yes. You're a real pain in the butt, you know. Just tell us what you freaking want. Yes, see? All right, then check this out. What's the matter? This is a peculiar looking flashlight, so whatever. Uh, I don't know what it is either. I inspected it pretty good. Yeah. But in the end, I couldn't figure it out. Huh? You couldn't? How do you so find? I asked someone for help. Could it be? You don't mean... <laughs> you wouldn't know? That's weird. Leave it to Monica. If someone has you worried, just let Monokuma take care of it. If you don't know something, I'll tell you if you need help. I'll help you. No if you don't way. like something, I'll fix it. So don't get rid of it. Please don't get rid of me. <laughs> Very bad when lady who act like that preys on you. What? Do you know what that from personal experience? Tell us, Monokuma, what is the flashlight? Yeah. Well, that's a flashlight. A flat. Whoa, whoa, what? <laughs> that's a flashback light? Uh -huh. Flashback light? Huh? Flashback? My, my. Hey. That flashlight doesn't shed light on darkness. It sheds light on your lost memories. Right. Lost memories. Yeah. You guys, yeah. well, that seems very important, doesn't it? 
You guys seem concerned that you couldn't remember how you came to the school. But if you use that flashback light, you can remember everything. Ah, oh, great. They wouldn't be anime without flashbacks. Huh? With this light? Yeah. So it's your fault we don't remember when we were kidnapped, huh? May I? Uh, what did you do to us, and how did you steal our memories away? Maybe if you use the flashback light, you'll be able to remember that this too. I don't believe it. No way this flashlight will recover our memories. So it's kind of like the Men in Black thing, but with, with like reverse. Yeah. Yeah. I bet there were a lot of naysayers and skeptics when the telephone was invented too. Hey. Good um, point. All right. For your information, the flashback light can treat various symptoms of memory loss. The light it emits stimulates the basal ganglia and hippocampus. Not just that, but physical. I didn't realize how boring it would be to explain. Basically, it works like that. Hey, don't just give on, uh, give up explaining after a single sentence. What should we do? Um, what should we do? You mean, should we or should we not use the flashlight? No. No way, I refuse. It uh, reeks of fishiness. Mm. Yeah, Gonta, no Kimbuli flashlight can bring back memory. Well, well, why not ask someone who knows machines? We've got the ultimate adventure right here. Uh, You're a bunch of ultimate dumb butts. No freaking way that can treat amnesia. Then again, these aren't exactly normal circumstances. Well, In such an uncanny environment as this, common sense has no place. Uh, well, I mean, there are those neuralizer things, the flashy things from Men in Black, but she said it! <laughs> Dude, they have references for everything in this game. I feel like that's just some information that even if you have not seen the Men in Black thing, everyone knows about it. Well... Why are you talking about a movie? This is real life. I guess. You're right, sorry. I don't like that. I don't think we should do it. I'm scared it might cause some weird side effects. <sighs> I'm worried how it'll affect my magic. All of you. Has everyone spoken? If we're in accord, I will consent as well. Then. What about you, Shuichi? I have, you have not said anything huh? yet? I... Alright! It's decided. Let's use it. What? Who decided it? We were all saying how dangerous it sounds. Jeez. Jeez, you guys are way too cautious. I mean, I understand why we're in such a weird situation after but all. You know. But we can't win by just running away all the time. Listen up. If you want to win, you've got to be a little reckless sometimes. If we can't face this danger, there's no way we'll be able to defeat Monokuma. <laughs> uh, well, aren't you confident? But you've no idea how we're supposed to win, do you? Ah. Yeah, I've got no clue, but still. Let's do it. If you want to win, you got to make a stand somewhere or you'll never move forward. If we run away, our kids will grow up to be the kind of people who run away from things like this. I don't understand. What are you talking about? You no. Know, if you still want to run away, then go ahead. I won't stop you or blame you. Okay. All right, let's go. <laughs> Wait, what's wrong? Everyone, are we going? Um, I'm staying. Listen up. After hearing that degenerate speech, running away would just frustrate me. Mm. Going to also stay is what true gentlemen would probably do. 100%. I also got to agree with Kaido. Our defeat is 100% assured unless we stand up to this. That's how I feel deep inside. Just a whisper. <laughs> he has human emotions. You hear it in your ghost? I'm pretty sure robots don't have ghosts, though. You ever seen ghosts in the show? Same. That is not funny. Leave me alone. <laughs> I shall stay as well. I suspect I will be able to uh, observe something most interesting. On your knee. If anything happens to me, you better beg my fans, the world, and huma humanity for for right. forgiveness. I just cannot talk. So what are you gonna do, Shuichi? Uh I'll okay. stay behind too. I have the spike after all. Got it. Right. I'll stay too. So if that might cause some weird side effects, that's no big deal. It seems as if everyone agrees with Kaito very well. I shall follow suit. <laughs> now it's decided. Hurry up and do. Woohoo! Then I'm gonna turn it on. Yeah. Someone just like falls over and dies. Click. Yeah, I'm surprised that like not once in the Danganronpa series has one has a person just been caught like murdering someone in cold blood. Oh, she turns it on. I have, oh, something's happening. The world works. Oh, hey, that's what happened. It's a Kaede. Okay. A lightning bolt in my mind shattered my consciousness like shrapnel, like a video game in fast forward. Scenes playing out in the back of my head. When the pieces of my psyche had gathered together again. I remember. I remember now. Oh, what the heck? He's running away, didn't he? I was running away. I had been running this entire time. I feel like we're in show and tell, guys. Look at like, I feel like I'm your teacher, like showing you the pictures. Guys, here's the picture. Here's the picture. You see that? That's a, that's a caterpillar. That's exactly how I feel when we play this. Look at this, guys. From the ultimate hunt. Those of us with ultimate talents were hunted down. I wasn't safe anywhere. 
Eventually, I had no place else to run. I was cornered and had to escape from the ultimate hunt. I threw away my ultimate talent to live as a normal high school student. By erasing my talents and my memories, I no longer had any reason to be hunted. If I didn't do what I did, I would have been captured, a fate worse than my death, or than death. And so I chose. I chose to gamble on the new technology developed in a particular facility. Future Foundation? Maybe? Technology that can put your memories to sleep by controlling your brainwaves. I use that to hibernate all memories related to my talent. That's it! Yes, I remember everything now. In order to escape the ultimate hunt, I erased my own memory. Hold up! Wait, did you say ultimate hunt? Huh? Really? You guys too? So it wasn't just me getting chased down in this ultimate hunt. I do not agree. Yes, you were not the only one. I know we were all being chased as well. So did everyone also receive their memories just now? We looked around at each other, each of us with the same shocked expression. What Kurumi said was true. We can't be sure that this is actually their memories. We don't really know that. We were all the same. We were all running from the ultimate hunt. In other words. All of us were being chased by the ultimate hunt. What on earth does that mean? Uh, oh wait, can someone tell me what it is? I can't seem to remember. What is the ultimate hunt? Geez. How could you forget something so important? Alright guys, the ultimate hunt is... What? Wait, I can't remember. Uh, um... I can't either. I suddenly realized I could not remember anything important de any of the important details to the ultimate but hunt. How? I can't remember anything either. I can only remember being chased. I can't remember anything else. No matter how hard I try, I can't remember. I don't want to live. Okay. I want to die with everyone else. Some strong words. I remember saying that, but why did I say uh... that? It's no use. I can't remember either. God damn it! This feels gross, like a crap that won't fully squeeze out. However, I, I hate it that I know what she's talking about. <laughs> Even if we can't remember, we should still be able to figure something out. Huh? Uh, what do you mean? <laughs> if we were all running from the ultimate hunt, then why are we imprisoned here? Why? Could it be? Could the reason be that we were caught by the ultimate hunt? Um. You mean we tried to escape by erasing our memories, but they found us anyway, and subsequently we were captured as part of the ultimate hunt. You know. Then this killing game yeah. is. How many times are they gonna say these freaking words? Let's see. So much ultimate hunt. I get it. Ultimate hunt. But but. Drink every time they say ultimate hunt. Some water, that is. But how disappointing. No one can remember anything. <laughs> what a disappointing disappointment. Piece of shit. Quit laughing about this, you little crap. It seems, as if... it seems losing him made a far bigger impact than we expected. Huh? Him. Yes. Yeah, Rontora. He seemed to know more than he let on. <laughs> I know. Of course he would be the first to die. Oh, he did say that. Does the term ultimate hunt ring a bell? Ah. He was the only one with his memories, and yet we freaking, he dies. Hmm. Why did only Ronta will remember the ultimate hunt? Listen. There's no point discussing that now. After all, he's already dead. <laughs> but if you truly wish to hear his words, I can perform a, se a seance for you. Don't screw around. Why not? Stop it. Don't bring up weird stuff like that. And why are you acting all girly all of a sudden? There he is again. Death can be really heartless. Why you? Says the root of all evil. <laughs> Looks like you guys safely got your memory back. Hey! What's going on, you stupid bear? The ultimate hunt makes no freaking sense. Yeah. Uh, it looks like you sh your sealed memories are more stubborn than I thought. Just one use of the flashback light wasn't enough to restore all your memories. You got me! You're such a terrible liar. You totally did that on purpose. Well. What connection do you have to the ultimate hunts? <laughs> I can't reveal that. Regardless of my true identity, my goal is crystal clear. Yahoo! And that is to make you guys participate in the killing game. That's my only desire. Yes, we have it. Oh, he's not... I thought he was going to give the freaking uh, motive. You gotta be kidding me! What's the killing him? I will never do that ever That's again. Right. We just gotta work together. If we cooperate, we'll make it out of here alive. <laughs> just like a certain someone did. I hate it. But, but I believe cooperating with each other is the most logical course of action. Why? Why are you sleeping? Whoa. What? Jeez. Hey, Kokichi, we're having a serious conversation here. And it is written somewhere that I have to take serious conversations seriously. <laughs> or is it? Quit acting so immature. Mm -hmm. I'm a teenager, so duh, I'm immature. Aren't you guys forgetting to act your age? What is it? What, I don't have a biological age. Ah. Don't worry about it, Kibo. I'm just talking to the humans right now. <laughs> so? What, what are we talking about again? Something about working together to escape, right? Mm -hmm. So you were listening, you horrible degenerate. See? You 
don't have to work together though. Let's just ask how we can get out. What's the point? If we ask Monokuma, he'll only say as the only way to win is the killing. We really game. don't get it. We're not gonna ask Monokuma. We're gonna ask the mastermind uh, among huh? us. I'm so sorry, I can't read. What? Why you? Are you already going senile? I thought we already agreed there's no mastermind. Hmm. Oh yeah, we did, didn't we? If we try to sniff out a mastermind again, we just repeat Kaede's screw up. You better quit messing you, around. Huh? You think I'm messing around right now? Oh, oh man, man, you really don't get it. I'm trying to get this through to everyone. If you keep saying all this uplifting stuff about working together and cooperating, <laughs> then you can expect to receive some painful retaliation, get it? Well, I do agree. Wait! What are you suggesting, Kukichi? That's enough! I'm gonna slug him. Whoa. He's gonna punch me? I gotta make a break for it. He definitely is smart. <laughs> He's fast. Sheesh. What a strange guy. Jeez. He just provokes people and says and never says anything from the heart. He's always messing around and making fun of those around him. <laughs> How can he say such insensitive things when we're trying so hard to survive? <laughs> it's like he doesn't even want to survive, though. I'm guessing I'm no different. Huh? What? In other words. Yeah, I don't plan to survive till the end. But she probably will too. Ryoma, um, you plan you not plan to survive? What that mean? That he has uh, he has mentioned that before. He has no reason to live. Okay. He doesn't have a reason to live. <laughs> Poor Ryoma. It seems he's got a more tragic past than we can ever begin to imagine. I mean, but the ultimate tennis pro shouldn't be saying such cowardly stuff. I just find it odd that the a tennis pro is so tragic. You think it would be like something else? What do you think? Perhaps we should relax over a meal. Okay. As after we finished the meal, Kirumi prepared us uh, prepared for us. We decided to return to our rooms. All right. So we gotta figure out what the ultimate hunt. That's their main concern right now. So they're just gonna be talking about that. So I did some research, and apparently, if you get the key of love, apparently you get a special scene with a certain character. I don't know who. No, ding dong, bing bong. This is an official announcement. 10 p.m. For now. Okay, got it, got it, got it. Hmm. Nighttime already. Today really flew by too. As I lay in my bed, Ryoma's words came back to me. Hmm. Reason to live. When I really think about it, what do I have? I want to see my family and friends again, but is that the reason to live? But. How was it for Kaede? I'm sure she had plenty of reasons to live. That's the kind of girl she was. But I... Why am I thinking about this? I shouldn't be thinking this stuff. I know I need to stop thinking that way, but when I'm alone, I can't help Damn her. Damn it! It wasn't fair! With all my willpower, I forced myself to sleep. Um... Is he sleeping? Mm -hmm. Hey, hey, what, what are they doing in my room? Oh. You mean out like a light? More importantly, Who cares? Just hurry and leave the present so we can get out of here. Hmm. Don't rush me. Jeez, it's dark in here. I can't. I can't tell which is which. I think we're about to get our first motive, guys. Yeah, I don't know. Let me know if I should uh, do the whole love thing. I'm kind of scared of the comments, to be honest. I, I just kind of I want to stay away from some of that stuff, but I don't know. I I I, I want to at least see it for myself. Whatever it is. Anyway, we dropped off some presents in your room. And that's that. Now we're in fear because hell starts here. So long. Yep, yeah. there it is, baby. I already know it. A present, what does that mean? Oh, the present. When did this get here? It looks like a monopad, but it's not. It says Cubs Pad on the back in fine print. Huh? Cubs Pad? When I touched the screen, the device came to life. It started playing a video. Ooh. By popular demand, it's time for the motive video! Who's the most important person in your life? And now, without further ado... I knew this wasn't gonna be good. <laughs> Kaito. Whoa. I get to see them too? Kaito Momota! The ultimate astronaut! He really is an astronaut, what the heck? Thanks to his exceptional talent, this young man is already an astronaut trainee. Wow, our team has managed to score an exclusive interview with his grandparents. They miss their grandson terribly and hope he returns to them safe and sound. But don't just take my word for it. Let's hear it straight from the source. 
Kaito, as long as you're alive, I don't need anything else. Oh, come on, not his grandparents. No matter what happens, you must live. You must never give up. Please, live on, for our sakes too. Their only wish is for Kaito to live. Will Kaito be able to fulfill his grandparents' wish? How do they know? Are they watching us on TV? Ah, yes. One more thing. Shortly after this interview wrapped, these old farts suffered no! an unfortunate accident. <laughs> what kind of accident? It's a secret. Find out for yourself. Oh, uh, so, yep. Of course, he's going to want to get out of there. Huh? What was that? Uh, a motive um... video, but could this be another one of Monokuma's motives? If it were, why do I have Kaido's motto? No. If I think about that stuff later, I should hurry up and tell uh, Kaido. I ran into the hallway to on a mission to find Kaito. So, like, does everyone have each other's motive? Um. Has anyone seen Kaito? You seem in a panic over the Cubs pad, if I'm not mistaken. Huh? Uh, You're not the only one who got one, Shuichi. Uh -oh. We all did. Yes. We all have been given motive videos. However, they have been mixed up. Huh? When I woke up, there was a Cubs pad in my room, but the video on, on it wasn't even mine. So, Mugi, we should discuss this once everyone is here. Huh? Sorry, you're right. Uh, um, uh, what do you mean everyone else is here? Yes. Kaito and Kibo went to gather everyone else's so they may discuss our plans. Yes. Shall we wait for everyone then? Until the until then, we can provide you all with uh, ma massages? Is that what you said? <laughs> Thank you for waiting. We gather everyone else. Dear. My word. And after I was about to finally experience one of Karumi's famed massages. What is it? What do you mean? Are you also suggesting that I cannot read the air? Well, so what is it? Why'd you guys drag us here? On, Didn't I tell you? It's about the Cubs pads. Monokuma gave us a new motive and we can't not talk about is that it. So? That thing looks like another monopad. Was that a motive? Huh? Or that was a motive? Maki, haven't you watched the video? Okay. I ignored it because I figured it was something stupid. Uh... That's actually really courageous in a weird sort of way. Alright, All right, so what is it? So... Hmm... Honest! Why Gonta get Sumugi's video? Hey! hey don't say it, Gonta! Huh? Huh? Uh, I hear, uh, I heard it. I see. So Gonta has my video. What happened? Gonta's not supposed to say it. So like, what is Gonta's video? Like, Bonakuma just holding a gun to a bug. This this prey mantis will get it. No, we cannot exchange them. Why? Why? Their videos are the most important people in our lives, no. and that is just precisely why we cannot exchange them. Oh, because if they do, then that will cause people to want to kill each other. Yeah, that's pretty smart. Listen closely. No, though, uh, I think I know what's gonna happen, guys. The fact that freaking, the fact that Gonza just, like, said that he, she, the fact that Gonza just said that he has some Moogies probably means that she's, he's gonna be a target now. Man. No. I'll be so, Samugi, I'll never forgive Samugi if she kills Gonza. I don't know how she could, but just saying, I'm against why? it. Why? Against it, why? If you see the video, it might turn into a motive, right? <laughs> That's why I want to see it. Uh, you do? Okay. Always you were saying around. something like that before. You don't plan on surviving. It might not matter to you whether you would get killed or not. But we're different. We all want to live. Wake up already. You're like a, you're like some zombie wandering around with no will to live. <laughs> no will to live, huh? Hmm. If that's how you see me, then so be it. Not cool. But uh, I got plans to change my opinion. That's just not cool. What? I've got no plans. What did you say? Mm. Who cares? Raymond just stated his opinion. Because Actually, I feel the same way as him. Kichi. Are you trying to cause trouble again? So Don't get the wrong idea. I'm not saying we shouldn't care about killing or dying. <laughs> but I think it'd be better if we didn't cooperate with each other. <laughs> Actually, we definitely shouldn't cooperate with each other. Why? Why? Because? Well, yeah, that would... I, I could see... Maybe people will, like, let their guard down, you know? Whenever we tried to work together, Monokuma would retaliate with a plan to make us suffer. It happened with Kaede wanted to us to cooperate again with these motive videos, right? <laughs> Which means the more we try to cooperate, the more he'll try to make us suffer. Damn. You were saying that if we do not rally together, we will not ma be made to suffer? Just... That's why I had no choice but to screw with you guys, but you ingrates didn't even notice. That's... And you're not lying to us right now? Well, you know. Whether I'm lying or not, what I'm saying is still true. You know? Anyway, we shouldn't force ourselves to cooperate. Let's all just do our own thing. I agree with Ryoma's Ryoma suggestion. It's because we're trying to cooperate that Monokuma is making us suffer. But what about everything we went through? What was the point of Kaede sacrificing herself? So that means... Anyway, I'm warning you all for your sake. Let's just exchange the motive videos instead of cooperating. Incomprehensible. I cannot comprehend that logic. See? So are they going to do it or what? Huh? Wait, Gonta too? Because... He said, Con she, he said Gonta, let's go. We promised to think of a way to get everyone to exchange their motive videos, remember? So that means... Anyway, Kurumi, I'll hit you up later when I'm feeling hungry. Huh? Wait, did Gonta make promise? 
actually. Why can't you tell him when he's lying, Gonza? <sighs> Quit screwing around. Our sake? Yeah, right. I've had it with his lies. No. So are we all done here? Then I'm leaving. <sighs> Kurumi, bring me my dinner later. <laughs> I just hey. feel like I just feel like this rude though. Even if she is a maid. I'm heading out too. Hey. Wait up, Ryoma. Don't forget, we're all struggling to get out of here alive, so don't get in our way. Jeez. I have no intention of getting in your way. I'll never do something so uncool. Kurumi, could I get you to clean my room later? <laughs> Why does everyone actually? <laughs> she's gonna kill. She's gonna kill one of them for being so selfish. Everyone keeps leaving the room and tell her to do something different. My workload has increased significantly. This calls for a more tactical approach. <laughs> Come on, you can't spoil them. They'll just turn into ungrateful leeches. Eh? Wait, what's wrong, Himuko? Himuko, are you hungry? What? And how about we eat together? Kurumi, one tripe hot pot, please. Um. Tiko, you're giving her more work? Himiko? What's wrong with her? Oh, she must have seen. She must have seen her own motive then. Uh. You don't get it, Tinko. Himoko isn't hungry. I know because I have the almighty Atua. <laughs> well, let's just enjoy some tripe hot pot. Jeez. Jeez, you're so careless, Tinko. Oh my god, what's wrong with her? We also promise not to show each other the motive. So we have one hand, one group of people don't want to show the motives and the other do. This is going to be interesting, guys. But I think that's a great place to end it. I mean, not really. It's just that the, these chapters are so long. That's all the time I have to record today. But guys, thank you so much for smashing like, of course. Right? You're smashing like. And yeah, I want to know if I should do that, like, love hotel. I, I don't know if I should try to get that key from the casino. Apparently, that's one of the most important things from the casino. So and I think there's some other things. But... Yeah, this is really, really interesting. I like that this game does include mini games and stuff like that. But either way, guys, subscribe to become a scrub of the day, possibly, because whenever I do it, <laughs> you never know. You don't know until you're subscribed, and that way you don't miss out on some more Danganronpa. And uh, yeah, thank you for the support, and I'll see you scrubs in the next episode, because I'm pretty sure next episode somebody's going to die. And that's kind of how we do these episodes. But all right, I'm out. Bye, guys.